Hey everybody, it is after harvest time. Things are winding down and getting colder and it's gratitude season. Are you feeling very grateful? If not, stay tuned. Hi, it's Laura Giles with Pan Society. Thanks so much for tuning in. If you're not feeling very grateful today, then I hope by the end of this video, you'll find lots of little ways to feel gratitude every single day. So why should that matter? Well, gratitude is one of the things that leads to happiness. It leads to having meaning in your life. If you can find things to be grat grateful for, then you can be happy every day. It's really that simple. Um, there are studies in this. If you care about all of that, it's positive psychology. You can look it up. But in the practical sense, the um, more that you can feel good about the little things, the easier it's going to be to be a happy person. So, for example, you could be great, grateful that you're alive. A bunch of people are not alive. <laughs> look in the history of the world. Everybody dies. You're not dead yet. So <laughs> that's something that you could be grateful for. Um, something that happens every single day, whether we see it or not, is that the sun rises and that allows us to all still be here. Easy enough to be grateful for that. Um, another thing that most of us can honestly say is that we have food to eat. Really simple thing, right? We have family. Even if you don't um, like your family, even if you're not in touch with your family, if you have family, you're blessed. You're really lucky. Um, if you have a job, super lucky if you have the ability to tune into YouTube right now and watch me you're better off than most people you're just so much more blessed than most people if you um, I don't know think about something about yourself your physical features that you really like if you have that thing you're lucky super cool huh yeah if you look going around waiting for things like oh, if I don't have a lottery then I'm just gonna have a miserable day Oh, if somebody um, didn't talk to me nicely, I'm going to have a miserable day. Oh, if the sun's not out and it's not beautiful, and you know, then it's going to be a miserable day. Well, the things that happen with that is that you're making it so hard to be grateful and you're putting your gratitude in the hands of someone else that it's hard to be grateful. It's hard to be happy. Why would you do that? You're in total control over that. And in the animist world, you know, think about how all of these things are interconnected. So in order for me to get to work today, I had to get in my car. Now look at all of the people in the world who came together to create that car. And then the driver to drive it to the dealership and then the salesperson at the dealership to sell it to me. And then the people who maintain it for me all so I can drive to work today. So it's all in the web of life. All those magical things happened so that I could come to work. Wow. And then I had lunch. You know, it's the little things. So I had lunch and um, I had some soup and somebody made that soup. Somebody grew all the ingredients for the soup and then they made it and then they sold it. Somebody sold it and then for me to eat it. And then you know, so I have all this great soup. I'm grateful for that. And then they could be grateful because they sold the soup to me. So all of these things are happening. All these little tiny things happening every day that we don't even think about that we could be grateful for. Like it's like life is conspiring to make us happy. And all we have to do is notice it and be like, oh, you know, how fantastic is that? And yet we go around like, I can't see you. I can't see you. <laughs> It happens all the time so it's really a choice what you want to look at and since you do know that this is one of the components of happiness you're gonna be here anyway living and breathing I mean might as well do it in a happy way right so look at all the things I've got a chair sitting in front of me all the people who got together to make the fabric to um, cut down the tree to shape the wood to sell it to bring it here to me so that I can have a chair I mean, I could do that for every single thing in this room and be like, wow, how lucky am I? You know, I have family. 
You know, my parents got together, had babies, there was doctors involved, there was all kinds of people involved in the rearing of these people so that I could have a family. Oh, super cool. So we're all very grateful. And I hope that you are able to look at your blessings in a different way and to make this day a happier one. And then, you know what? Share it. You know, look at these people around you who are maybe not noticing all the blessings that they have in their life and give them a smile. Give them something that um, might help them remind them of that. You know, everything that we send out comes back to us. So let's make it a better world for ourselves and everyone else. Hope that you are enjoying the gratitude in this season. And I hope to see you on the next Pam video soon. Ciao.